All right, we got exercise more. No question, that is always the most popular. Lose weight, that's a little perceiving because that's a little bit the same thing. Get organized, always nice. Learn a new skill or hobby, that's fun. Uh, live life to the fullest, that is great. But that's uh, pretty hard to measure that one. Uh, okay. These are New Year's resolutions. We all have them, we've all heard of them. Uh, they're also called goals, and Radius Plus has goals. We have a lot of goals. Headed in the new calendar year, we have uh, a long list of things that we want to accomplish. Um, for example, one of them is actually the entire team is trying to collectively lose weight together. Whichever branch loses the most weight gets three extra vacation days. No, I'm just kidding. We do have a lot of, of goals headed into the new year that we're planning on accomplishing. So without further ado, here are the list of five items that we want you to know about headed into 2021. Number one is expansion into Canada. That's right, we're trying to get a little bit more friendly with our neighbors to the north. So we're planning on tracking all facilities and development projects within Canada, including demographic information from their own census data, as well as updating satellite imagery, so that way all the facilities are captured within the Radius Plus map. Number two is something that you've heard us talk about quite a bit recently, it's rate analytics. Rate data is something that our team really prides themselves on. We are expanding historical rate data to include all dimensions advertised on the facility's website, including promotions, tracking inventories, etc. So for example, if a facility has um, $20 off the first two months, that promotion is gonna be captured within the Radius platform. Number three is data cleanup. Self-storage industry seems to be a bit ancestral in the sense that a lot of facilities change names, uh, they go under new management, a lot of acquisitions. Um, we just want to make sure we are as up-to-date as possible for you with all that data. This is something that we already take very seriously and have daily scraping to make sure the data is as up-to-date as possible. Uh, but nonetheless, it's definitely on this list to make sure that every facility is properly named. Number four is implementing a system to rate facilities. So this is something that our team has been working on internally um, to better categorize all of the inventory of self-stored facilities we have um, so you can sort of better allocate them for your needs. So for example, if a REIT has 24-hour video surveillance and also offers climate control units, we'll classify them as a Class A facility, whereas if a smaller facility just has drive-ups and no security, we might classify them as a Class B. It's kind of like how the Department of Health rates restaurants based on health guidelines, um, except we're going to be doing it um, based on self-storage features for your needs. Number five um, is something that our tech team is pretty excited about. It is revamping our mobile app. Um, the mobile application is something that's been in existence for quite some time now, but 2021 is our year to uh, put this thing to the test. We want to be able to give you a lot of the same features that you'll be able to find within the desktop platform, um, but like right in your pocket. Well, <laughs> so looking at this list right here, um, these bottom two down here, one is spend more time with family and friends, and the next one is travel more. I, uh, I don't know if anybody had those on their 2020 New Year's resolutions, but uh, they probably didn't get a chance to do those if they did. But anyway, we just wanted to share our New Year's resolutions with you um, in the form of objectives and goals. But I um, hope you like this video. Um, comment on any ones that you want to see um, more prioritized or anything that we can do to better your Radius Plus experience. And uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks.